like, right, I'm at the canteen. Uh, now what? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. I think, it's, it is. I think it's all I'm imagining right now is he's like being all like ninja ninja and she's just like hanging off the top of the building going, sup. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> what you doing? <laughs> <laughs> she fucking cotton run fast. <laughs> <laughs> Why so serious? Wait, no. Ah, uh, whoops. Hold on. <laughs> I forgot. I need to get the need to get the walkthrough open. <laughs> What do we choose here? Hold on a second. I forgot we have to have to make decisions yes. in this game. Yes, it's a visual novel. It isn't that other one. Uh, more, yet yeah, more professionalism. No, oh, we, we, from we're Expect Lag like Productions. <laughs> right, day six. Okay, we're on Slavia's route. We're taking food for Slavia. Want to get something for Slavia? Yep, that's definitely a decision. Oh, really? Oh, really? Yeah, that'd be the reaction I'd have right now, too, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, really. Ah. Mm -hmm. Seems like Uliana's doing us a solid. Although, knowing Uliana, she's like... You owe me. <laughs> knowing Uliana, there's a 50-50 chance here that she'll either be really good and get us some food, or just go... Hey everyone! Simeon's out back! Fucking hunt. go get him! <laughs> <laughs> oh. no, she's she's doing us a solid. Good on her. Yes, nice. but why? Because <laughs> uh, she's a fucking dweeb. <laughs> Best regards to Slavia. Ah, <laughs> uh, that was weird. Stood there for some time in confusion, like, now is not the time to stand there confused. Yeah. <laughs> I'm with you there, Simeon. Just like, nope, that wasn't, <laughs> nope. Who was this person and where's Ulana gone? <laughs> What are the odds you secretly tipped everyone off and also got food? Played both sides. Yep. So, yep. So, Slavio entered sleep mode. <laughs> like, you just see see a light turn on behind her eyes. And, like, <laughs> you hear the fucking... <laughs> you hear, like, a hard drive starting to... <laughs> and then the uh, Windows... You got it so fast. The Windows XP startup sound. <laughs> oh, by the way, for reference, I've moved on to Record Delic. Strawberry and lime cider. By the way, <laughs> drinking on a Friday night. I'm allowed to do so. I We're swear. adults. We pay taxes. <laughs> I'm fifty-five thousand dollars in debt to my government. <laughs> <laughs> the least I could like the least I should be able to do is drink on a Friday night. <laughs> oh god. Maybe I shouldn't I don't know, like I am I'm, I'm in debt, like, but is it a wise idea to mention like the level to, to which I'm in debt? I don't know. Student loans are a bitch. <laughs> Up to you. No one no one I don't think I don't think uh Anyone would disagree with me on that. That's fine. Just keep it in. <laughs> what do you mean by God. deal with the camp leader, Simeon? Walk up behind her and shiver in the neck? Wait. Wrong, wrong, ki wrong kind of game. Yeah, that's, that's another game. <laughs> oh, God. Involves eagles and white hooded figures. Hold on. Are we, are we, what, what game are you thinking of? I'm not 
I don't know if we're on the same page here. I win Assassin's Creed. <laughs> oh, do I? Yeah. Or, you know, there's always Yandere. I love you, so I'll kill you. Yeah, clearly, Semyon is a Yandere. Oh, yeah, totally. Maybe that could be the title of this episode. <laughs> Semyon's a Yandere. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, this is an act of protest after all but you weren't willing to make it a hunger strike <laughs> she must be aware she can't order me around order us around order us around <laughs> oh christ so Slavia is just coming along for the ride it seems <laughs> yeah she's like fuck it let's see where this goes this should be amusing for a couple <laughs> hours, and then I'll walk back to camp. Yeah. I mean, remember, this is like a 25-year-old man, like... Mentally speaking. No, you did it in 17-year-old... Sure right way? You did it in 17-year-old yeah. judicial boy way. How you talk way. to someone about something like that? Exactly, how you talk to someone is just as important, if not more important, than what you talk to them about. Mm. Small talk's a bitch. I've been told I'm quite good at small talk, mind you. Mm. I don't know. Neither. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Yawn. Uh, <laughs> I'm hoping my yawning isn't too obnoxious. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's not too oh, bad at my end. Knows. But, uh... <laughs> Simeon's just like... I don't know. I don't want to be a beta cuck. I don't know. And then Slavish is just like... Oh. You idiot, you probably did it the fucking 17-year-old way. <laughs> Yes, he's clearly Prince Charming. That's clearly the clearly the uh, way he's going for. And uh, Slavia is clearly a damsel in distress. Well, she does. <laughs> An evil witch. <laughs> clearly, you know. Are we to learn that that uh, Slavia was not given choice in being the camp's errant girl, and that it's clearly forced labour, or else they'll, or else Olga will break her parents' legs or something? Yep, <laughs> definitely, <laughs> definitely KGB agent. <laughs> oh God, yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> the Stasi. Well, no, that's East Germany, not the Soviet Union. Hmm. <laughs> yep. But no, seriously, though, read about the Stasi. It's The Lives of Others. is a very interesting movie about Cold War era East Germany. And basically, the closest the world ever got to Big Brother is watching you. Except it wasn't Big Brother. It was your neighbor, your cousin, your brother. Everyone was watching and everyone else, you know? It was a very, it's a, like, they had, they did legit, they did legitimate gaslighting stuff like coming home, you know, like breaking into houses and rearranging furniture or personally ensuring everything and, an, like an anti-citizen or whatever, every, like if someone was against the government, the, the Stasi would do stuff like ensure every project they were involved in failed to, to break their spirit. You know, it was uh, quite scary to think about. Mm. Clearly, that's, clearly, that's the sort of thing that's happening to Slavia. All Slavia is just going along for the ride, and Simeon's now just like, oh, I'm digging my hole here, and I'm going to keep digging it. God. But he's also going like, shit, I have a girl who like actually wants to be with me and, you know, go along with what I suggest. Uh, I don't know how to deal with this. I'd be lying if I didn't kind of... I'd, I'd be lying if I, if I said I couldn't empathize with that feeling. Like, you know... 
that feel when no GF and then suddenly GF. He still no, doesn't. And he's still with that. I don't know. I don't fucking know. Indecision's a bitch, huh? Let's just fucking go back. <laughs>